as war changes, we evolve. So it's, it's pretty much necessary to uh, have a vehicle that withstands the things that we, uh, that we experience today in today's wars. The LTV is a joint light tactical vehicle. It's the vehicle now that's going to be taking over the place of the Humvee. With these being new vehicles, the CVOC course, combat vehicle operational training course, allows them to actually go into training and um, testing the capabilities that the uh, vehicle was meant for to push it past its limits. Ready? Good. All right, so uh, some of the major keys in this uh, vehicle, in the JLTV, um, one is the DSVU. That's this monitor placed here. Um, this monitor does its own PMCPS checks, so you can check the systems right here. You have your CTIS, which highway, crossway, mud, standard, slow emergency. That changes the, uh, the inflation of the tires. Another uh, key thing in this vehicle is the battery auxiliary on this side, on the uh, left side of the steering wheel. It allows the vehicle to uh, slave start itself so you don't need the assistance of another vehicle. Um, you have a slave cable on the front and a slave cable on the rear passenger side. All you need is slave cables connected and the vehicle can pretty much jumpstart itself from the second battery that it has. These vehicles increase the survivability rate. If we increase the survivability rate in these vehicles, that will increase the, the mission accomplishment within the MEF. So I think whenever we do deploy or we have, like we're prepared for like uh, any uh, type of terrain or any situations that we're faced with out there with these vehicles.